What's that now? Don't like the cold? Can't stay in today. We have a ritual to perform, you and I. your name, girl. But will the goddess speak it back? Normally it would be the mother who declares, if you had one. The whole village would attend and matriarchs perform the ritual, but we are outcasts. Even so, we keep the tribe's rituals. Otherwise, we might become like the faithless old ones who turned their backs on the goddess. But their wickedness doomed them. To us, we're left the splendors of creation, beasts of air, water, earth and steel. It is one thing to hunt a beast, another to hunt a machine. You must be humble and respect their power. I will teach you this. One day. No, 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 off your knees. It's nearly time. And yes, you may speak to me. You came to bless the naming. Have not six months gone by since we entrusted her to you? But we are outcasts. You by choice. And she, well... <laughs> I am a high matriarch, Rost. I bless whom I choose. Then you honor us. Yes, yes, now go and be ready to declare. Go! Oh, mother, this child needs a name by which to know her. That your love may warm her life as the rising sun warms all the earth. Speak her name! Aloy! And so her name is blessed. Stop this at once! What have you done? I've blessed the naming of a child. Stubborn woman, you call that curse a child? What did she tell you about his birth outcast? Answer! I've done only what you asked. To raise it, yes. We said nothing of love. Enough. And you, blessing its name like it was one I know my duty to them. Tried. And to you. Without consultation. I'm here. And wherever you go, I will follow. Ladies and gentlemen, 
side strafe back and today I begin my playthrough of Horizon Zero Dawn. I'll be live streaming this on twitch.tv as well as locally recording for higher quality here on the YouTube channel. Hope it's appreciated. Very much looking forward to this one. So with that, let's begin. Together, aren't you, little bast? Now go and see if you can find some more. Hmm? Well done. That's a good boy. Children, come with me. She's an outcast to be shunned. There. Oh, come on. Gift from the past. How's that for a seamless transition? Oh! You sure this isn't a Batman origin story? This must be a ruin of the metal world. One of the old places. The metal world. I think it's safe to say this is more than a cave. Ross said never go in places like this. But I have to find a way out. We've got like desks and chairs over there, over here. More bats. There is something up ahead. What's that? A dead person. 
generally not a good thing. There's something shiny there. One way to get the power back up. I wonder if you can see anything or make anything out. Does this say Faro? F A R O? Can't really see anything else though. So this activates it on off. A metal door closed. Maybe this device I found can help. How do I get it open? Bunker door, blast door, heavily shielded, seal integrity maintained. A shape. It's connected to the door somehow. So this is a bunker. Military bunker, fallout type deal, I wonder. So intriguing. There's a thing over there. For Director Evans, voice log data corruption severe. SRC. Black quartz encryption. I've rooted the message to your hollow grid for viewing. USRC. Why 
What's that? You think I want it this way? It's the best I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Show me. Show me again. I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! Hi. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but... We can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. <laughs> I can't imagine experiencing all of this as a little kid. I mean, first of all, I'd probably be freaked out that I'm in this crazy bunker with you know, dead bodies everywhere. And then running into all this technology. Find a way out. We can go that way, but there's this route as well. Well, Happy New Year, dear diary. Can you believe we actually celebrated last night? Well, we did. Kind of. Director Evans invited everyone to gather in the community room. Don't know where she got the party hats. That was a ghoulish touch. So there we sit watching the clock tick down to midnight, and I'm thinking, am I the only one who gets the symbolism of this? It might have been worth it if Skylar had gotten drunk again, but I seem to be a mistake she doesn't want to repeat. I saw them lining up in the community room. Like cattle in a slaughterhouse, but smiling at each other. Shauna handing out meds like being alive is some kind of pain to be eased. Well, not me. I don't want to go quiet. I don't want to trail off. I want a period at the end of my life sentence, not an ellipsis. Hell, <laughs> an exclamation mark. So if that upsets whoever finds this, too bad. I don't know anyone anything anymore oh well he took the bullet way out
Man, they were losing it. And maybe that's all I need, you know? That moment the door opened and you were standing there wearing that retro weave dress and the way you smile. I had to look away, are you gonna see? On my face. What had just blossomed inside me, you know? It was just an instant, but I knew. I knew we'd be forever. And pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. I mean, uh, death. I'm sorry. It's been a while. And, well, these meds Johnny gave us are really something. So, uh, okay, from the top, kids. <clears throat> Hail Mary, full of grace. What were they waiting for? It's like... Their number was up and they knew it and they were just trapped in here. Got some flashing numbers up here. don't belong down there. Come! <sighs> Such places are forbidden, Aloy. I fell in. They are of the metal world. What is that on your face? Nothing. Did you find it down there? No. Give it to me. No. Aloy! Such things are dangerous. No! <sighs> well, if you're gonna go sneaking away from home, you'll need to know how to survive in the wild. Come, Aloy. Home now. But starting tomorrow, you will learn to hunt. muttering to that plaything. We descend to the valley now. Follow. The wilds can be dangerous, Aloy. You will need to stay close and do as I say. I know. Now. You're still scratched up from that fall you took yesterday. So let's start there. Take this medicine pouch. I'll show you how to fill it. See this plant over here? It's called South Rush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Gosh, this game is gorgeous. <laughs> Aloy, come now. Gather the berries. I'm busy looking at pretty things. I told you, gather the berries. Good. Now eat the berries. Blech. They may taste bitter, but they can save your life. 
Always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Where are we? This valley is just a part of All Mother's embrace. Embrace? The Nora tribe watches these lands and keeps out the most dangerous machines, usually. Further down river, we'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All machines are dangerous, Aloy. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. Too close for comfort. Come back this way. The slower you move, the quieter you'll be. And crouched walking is quieter than upright. Wait for it. That's the last of them. Let's move on. You did well. They didn't see or hear you. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead. Ah, it's crazy to think this is running on a console. and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. Then he is a fool. Come now. Let's find that herd. Follow. These robo-horses? Animals are deadly enough without them being robots. There. See them? These are called striders. Ha! Get! Why'd you chase them off? Huh. <sighs> Show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. 
I will show you how to use them. Good. That's it. Those will do. Follow. The lighting's also Stop fantastic. Wasting time. Oh, okay, sure. <laughs> Aloy, over here. There's the herd. All right. It's time to throw some rocks. But rocks can't hurt machines, right? No, but they can distract them. Draw them into traps. Like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with, or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy. Unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. There. Come, girl, it's safe now. That'll work. Gosh, the lighting. Harvest the kill so I can teach you how to make arrows. Good. Now. Gather stalks of Ridgewood from the plants over there. One of two. Use the stalks as arrow shafts and metal shards for arrowheads. Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. Let's do that. Are we creeping again? Here. Stay low on the grass and be quiet. It's time to make your first kill, Aloy. Strider, one of the weaker machines, but even a weak machine can kill a hunter if she's careless. You must study your prey. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable, like its eye. Can you guess another? On its back. Is that a weakness? Shins? How did you guess that? The device. It showed me. But that plaything? Stop playing games. Now, take down that strider. Target the eye or the canister. And if it charges, be ready to roll out of the way. You did well today, but you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. The one running the Brave Trails. 
Follow Eloy, quick! Hustle up, Buttercup. What kind of trouble has that kid gotten himself into? I'm one to talk. Oh boy. Slowly and quiet. Got their pathing. Got to be careful. Another one up front over there. About the play thing. How are you doing? Shh. How is this possible? 
It's not gonna be possible if you don't shut your trap. I'm gonna wait till he goes back around. It's too close. Bless that girl. Bless you both. She, Boy! She saved me. I, I just wanted... Boy! Seal your lips. They are outcasts, both. And she is motherless. Come now. Back to Mother's heart. should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. We'll go home now. Follow. I know the way. Flashpoints offer moments of emotional choice. How Aloy expresses her personality is up to you. Uh, the fist for confrontation, the brain for insight, and heart for express compassion. <laughs> my, my initial instinct is to aim for his head. Knock the rock from his hands. Drop your rock. Oops, my finger slipped. Aw. He had it coming, Ross. Aloy, we cannot. It's my dark side moment. Hildran, away from there. Back to picking berries. <sighs> You're bleeding. Let me have a look. Here, hold still. I'll get it. Why? Why am I an outcast? Aloy, this is not the time. Who was my mother? Aloy, I've told you before, that's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the matriarchs brought you to me. So the matriarchs, they know? It's not so simple. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It would be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Tell me. The proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Then I'll do it. <laughs> Whatever it takes, I'll win the proving. I see. We'd best get started then. Your training will be hard, and it'll take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. <laughs> 